Uh, my name is Sean Bell. I go by XB. I take X from my name Sean and a B from Bell. So I call it myself. I go with XB. Uh, you can call me XB or Dr. Who, whichever you like. Uh, one thing that I really enjoyed from the students' comment is that I give a lot of examples. Um, in my class, uh, I use examples from I-44, the, uh, the freeway. I use examples of Bishop Avenue. I use examples of 10th Street. And I use examples of the traffic problems on this campus. For example, the parking problem, uh, the pedestrian problem, uh, the bike sharing, uh, the shuttle issue, we don't have shuttle, that kind of things. So, um, f uh, over the last uh, uh, two semesters, I feel students enjoy those examples. Uh, what I believe is really important is to be practical. I mean, for sure, we will talk about mathematical equations, we will discuss what are parameters to use. Um, but I believe that if you, uh, if you see the real-world examples on campus, in, in the city, in the state, if you can link whatever we learn in the classroom with those real problems, I believe I can get your attention. If I have 100 hours, I really hope I can do more research on autonomous vehicles. Uh, surely, I mean, the traditional traffic engineering research is exciting, such as how to optimize signals, um, how to design a transit system. But however, traffic engineering has been uh, changing so much recently. If you think of Uber, uh, Google Maps, they give you a really good idea. But the topic that got me really interested, really excited, is autonomous vehicles. I believe that's the future. Autonomous vehicles will help us decide um, how to best drive on the road so we can sit in the vehicle and relax. We can look at uh, our computers, we can uh, do our things when we are driving. We don't have to worry about the traffic. We don't have to worry that our vehicle is running to crash. We don't, we don't have to worry that we need to sit in front of the traffic signals. So that's really exciting part. And the secondary autonomous vehicle uh, will enable us to collect a lot of data from the traffic. For example, how many vehicles are around of us, how many, uh, how many pedestrians there, uh, there are. So with that, that enables us to do the, we call it transportation big data analytics, which is another very exciting field. I always appreciate the, uh, the importance of traffic engineering. Um, particularly, I mean, when, when we think of traffic engineering, we think of freight, transportation, logistics, uh, airport, uh, traffic signals, and we know those infrastructures are fundamentally important to, to our state, to, the, to our country, to the uh, economy. So and that's why I always have a passion for, these, uh, for, for traffic engineering. You can reach me at xbhu at mst.edu or you can find me in BCH 133. I look forward to working with you this semester.